The dreams of playing in the NFL begin with the NFL Pro Days on various campuses around the nation. Today, it's 11 athletes from Georgia Tech who look to impress the scouts and coaches from 32 NFL teams to earn a spot on a roster. The dream began at Pop Warner, continued through high school and on to the flats. And now the Brock Indoor Facility, the workout drills, the position drills. It's where the players will show off their ability and that they belong in the NFL. It is Georgia Tech NFL Pro Day. Welcome into the Brock Indoor Facility. Uh, I'm Nathan McCurry here with Roddy Jones, and it is a special day here on the campus of Georgia Tech for these 11 athletes who are trying to show they belong in the NFL. What an opportunity for them, and it's going to be an exciting day. We're going to be bringing it to you from A to Z, the workouts, uh, the, the, the workout drills, the position drills. Roddy, Nathan, it's, it's not about us. It's about these athletes today, Roddy. It definitely is. This is a dream come true for these athletes. You mentioned the fact that it starts in Pop Warner, goes to high school, and then on to Georgia Tech. Everyone aspires to play at the top level, and this is the first step for those guys to show what they have to NFL scouts up close in person. Let's take a look at the position players that will be competing today. It's 11 athletes, 10 who played uh, on the flats last season, and Sinjin Days comes back. An interesting story, signed with the Dallas Cowboys, uh, was cut uh, just after OTAs. He's coming back here to show the NFL scouts. He's still got it, been working out very hard. He has been. He's had an entire year to get his body ready for this moment, but as you can see, the guys uh, that are going to participate, it's going to be a fast group. Uh, Broderick Snotty's a track guy. Jamal Golden is is a fast guy. Damon Smith, Chris Milton, DJ White already ran, won't run today, but ran a great day, ran a great time at the combine. So I'm expecting to see some fast times. And there have been some workouts that have already taken place, the vertical jump and the broad jump. And here are your scores. And, uh, you know, pretty impressed. Sinjin Day's 10, uh, 10, 10 feet, 3.5 inches. Uh, anything above 10 is uh, is. is considered where they need to be. You're exactly right. And this is a test of pure explosiveness. How far can you propel yourself out? How high can you get yourself for? So for anyone who's jumping over 32 inches and jumping over 10 feet long, that's what, a, that's what they call a twitchy guy, a guy who's got those fast twitch muscles, the explosion, and that usually translates into a good 40 time. Well, let's talk about the mindset. And Now, you've comp competed in one of these things. Um, the season ends. The mindset of college career over... Can I make the next next step? What are these players doing to prepare for this day? Well, it, it, it immediately changes. Yeah. Once your college season ends, you're a professional at that point. You have to treat it as such. Uh, no matter what level you're going from and going to, you're competing against those guys that are already there. So you have to prepare your mind and body as if you are going to win an NFL job. And it starts as soon as your college season ends. So you find someone to train with. You begin to get your nutrition right. You start to talk about the, the next level in terms of uh, – the, the mental game as well and then obviously on the field is uh, uh, that's the that's a big thing uh, as you go forward yeah it sure is let's go ahead and take a look at the the pro scouts here that uh, are at Brock indoor facility um, and they're preparing for this uh, this big day for the athletes here at Georgia Tech 